Wait for me. Hey guys, what's up? I just want to say thank you all for those who helped me fix my issue about my screen recording. I am able to record with a high graphics now again. As a thank you, I made this Ruby tank video. So you can can get an idea what I do whenever I use Ruby as a tank. If you want a Ruby tank tutorial then make sure you check out my channel. I also pinned the link of my tank tutorials in the comment section. But since I am using Ruby as a tank here then I am sure that they won't be able to kill me instantly. I will buy magic shoes here for early cooldown since I am not going to buy defensive items that have a cooldown reduction. My second item is Radiant Armor because I know that, when Johnson get his ultimate then they will start to hunt. Radiant Armor will help me sustain Odette's damage. Athena's shield is also a good choice but Radiant Armor is the best choice. When it comes to battle spell, I highly suggest Vengeance for damage reduction. It helps you survive Odette's ultimate. Revitalized is also a good spell, helping you and your team regenerate HP while Odette's ultimate is on effect. I will explain this further later on, and give you an example how good this is, especially when you build enough items to counter their combo. Initiate retreat! Whenever you have the chance, try to block Johnson to stop their movement. Why? Because that will make your whole team safer and put their hearts at ease. We all know that when we do not know where the Johnson and Odette is, then we tend to be cautious and wary. Putting us in disadvantage situation. Especially our side lanes, making them think twice before pushing. In this moment, I do not see Johnson in my screen. But I know that they are coming because I hear them coming and see them in the map. So I try to block them, but my mistake is that my calculations was bad and I can't sustain their damage yet. Wait for me. This is the moment I am talking about emblem. Make sure you activate your battle spell before or after the impact of Johnson's ultimate. The stun of Johnson's ultimate is not that long so you have a chance to activate it upon the impact. This is the moment I am talking about emblem, make sure you activate your battle spell before or after the impact of Johnson's ultimate. The stun of Johnson's ultimate is not that long so you have a chance to activate it upon the impact. You just have to be fast when doing this because Johnson can stun you using his first skill, forcing you to stay in Odette's ultimate a little longer. When you want to block Johnson then make sure you have your ultimate or second skill ready because you need it to stop Odette's ultimate. This is for your team and your own sake.
Now that I have radiant armor, that Odette feels almost nothing. This is the moment that I no longer see her as a threat. But that is only possible because I have revitalize. I am just forcing them to stay until Karina got her ultimate. Preventing them from going home is also a good thing to do. If you do not understand then try to look at the map, you can see her that she positioned herself in the bush.
destroyed a triple kill. Thank you. Shut down. Sorry. Bad luck. Victory! Thank you all for watching. Stay safe and see you in our next video.